This is operation procedure for PG-30, PG-35 pressure initial setting mode. At first, step to initial setting mode. Press and hold the M button and the down arrow button simultaneously for at least one second. When the display shows either 111, 121, 131, the step to the initial setting mode is complete. Press the M button to move to the next setting mode. Each setting mode is explained here. When LED for plus minus flashes, the multiplier factor setting mode is selected. Press either the down arrow button or the up arrow button to select the desired multiplier factor. Press the M button once to move to the analog output mode next. When LED for switch 1 flashes, the analog output mode setting is selected. Press either the down arrow or the up arrow button to select the desired analog output mode. Press the M button once to move to the switch output setting mode next. When LED for switch 2 flashes, the switch setting mode is selected. Press either the down arrow or the up arrow button to select the desired switch output setting mode. Finally, press and hold the M button for at least one second. When the display is in operating mode, the settings are complete. This is operation procedure for PG-30, PG-35 pressure setting mode. At first, step to pressure setting mode. Press and hold the M button and the up arrow button simultaneously for at least one second. When switch 1 flashes and the display shows 50% of rated pressure as initial setting, the step to the pressure setting mode will be complete. Press the M button to move to the next setting mode. This is pressure setting mode. Each setting mode is explained here. This is switch 1 setting. When LED for switch 1 flashes, switch 1 pressure setting mode is selected. Press either the down arrow or the up arrow button to set the desired switch pressure value. This is switch 2 setting. Press the M button once to move to the switch 2 pressure setting mode next. When LED for switch 2 flashes, switch 2 pressure setting mode is selected. Press either the down arrow or the up arrow button to set the desired switch pressure value.
This is hysteresis setting. Press the M button once to move to the hysteresis setting mode next. When LED for plus minus flashes, the hysteresis setting mode is selected. Press either the down arrow or the up arrow button to set the desired hysteresis value. This is digital filter setting. Press the M button once to move to the digital filter setting mode next. When the display shows F0, the digital filter setting mode is selected. Press either the down arrow or the up arrow button to select the desired digital filter value. Finally, press and hold the M button for at least one second. When the display is in operating mode, the settings are complete. This is operation procedure for PG30, PG35 0 point adjustment non-display mode key protection mode. At first, zero point adjustment. Press and hold both the down arrow and the up arrow button simultaneously in the operation mode. 0 AD, will be shown on the display and the sensor will automatically adjust to 0 after about 1 second. When the display shows 0, 0 adjustment is complete. This is non-display temporary mode. Press and hold the down arrow for at least 4 seconds in the operation mode. SOF, will be shown on the display. When SOF is shown, release the button. The display will turn off after 10 seconds. When the decimal point starts to blink, the non-display temporary setting mode is complete. If you press any button, the display will be back. You can make settings of function with the buttons. If no button is pressed for 10 seconds, it will return to the non-display temporary mode. To cancel, Press and hold the down arrow for 4 seconds or longer, and, L on, will be shown on the display. When it is shown, release the button to cancel the non-display temporary mode and to return. This is non-display full-time mode. Press and hold the M button for at least 4 seconds in the operation mode. COF, will be shown on the display. When, COF, is shown. Release the button to turn off the COF display. The setting is complete when the decimal point starts to appear. The display goes out and no operation is accepted even if any button is pressed. To cancel, press and hold the M button for 4 seconds or longer, and, L on, will be shown on the display. When it is shown, release the button to cancel the full time off mode and to return to operation mode. This is key protection mode. Press and hold the up arrow button for at least 4 seconds in the operation mode. PL, will be shown on the display. When, PL, is shown, release the button to turn off the, PL, display. The setting is complete. The sensor continues to function, but it does not accept any operation change even if any button is pressed.
To cancel, press and hold the up arrow button for 4 seconds or longer, and PA will be shown on the display. When it is shown, release the button to cancel the key protection mode and to return to operation mode. Thank you for watching our PG30, PG35 operation.